Hello Pisces, how are you? Welcome to my channel Star 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 and welcome to your reading. So this is your reading for the month of May. In this reading Pisces will see uh, what are the top three things that you need to know for the month of May that might happen to you and apart from that we'll also see what are the love messages for you. This is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa and time is fluid. Uh... There is an extended reading for this one. <clears throat> Just excuse me, my throat. There is an extended reading for this one. Link for the same is in description box and comment section. All right. Let's get started now. Hit like, share, and subscribe. I see. <clears throat> Out of 100%. When I, when I see the statistics, 70 to 75% are the unsubscribed viewers. So I request you to subscribe to this channel. That will, that will only help me with the views and that will help this channel to grow. <clears throat> All right. So I have shuffled the cards. I'll lay them down and then we'll discuss the energies. The top three events are King of Swords, first one, the Queen of Cups, second event, third is the Star. When it comes to your love life, what are the love messages? We have the Tower. <clears throat> Seven of Wands. the moon bottom of the deck we have nine of nine of swords so pisces if i have to talk about the zodiac signs i see aquarius cancer scorpio libra uh gemini is what i heard so all the all the air signs hmm I'm also hearing Pisces, so all water signs and all air signs. If the sign pops up, all the better. Let's not remain fixed on the signs. Apart from that, you might be seeing a lot of uh, 777, a lot of 555, and a lot of uh, 999 as well. Okay. Right. So let's talk about the top three events. The first one is King of Swords. King of Swords is telling me, Pisces, that you are going to meet a mentor in the month of May. And this is a very strict mentor. A very strict mentor. I mean, this mentor is a part of your destiny. They are entering in your life to discipline you, to put you on the right track and push you towards your destiny. There is something that is missing in your life right now that is necessary for your growth. It might be a discipline, it might be motivation, it might be uh, strong willpower, dedication and devotion to do something, to chase your goals. There is a lack of something in your life right now. And it's not just something that is you are you have experienced since last couple of days. No, I think so. This lack of something that is very necessary for your success. This lack of something you are experiencing since last couple of months. And I'll also tell you why you are experiencing this, whether it is a lack of discipline or motivation or whatever it is. I think so. There is a lot of stress in your life. Okay, the stress is because increased domestic responsibilities or the stress is because of some uh, health problems that you're dealing with. The stress is because uh, probably you're running around uh, 
multiple jobs uh, to take care of your uh, monthly expenses there is something that is troubling you there is something that is uh, causing stress financial situation or maybe strained relationships with someone external factors have increased uh, uh, put on some toll on the internal factors like the balance and the emotions that you experience so what i feel over here pisces is that you are meant to do something in this lifetime you have a life purpose and it's not a mediocre one it is a it is something big and if something big is meant to happen you have to be an equally disciplined person a strong willed person a highly dedicated and devoted person you need to learn to manage yourself and you need to learn to manage your energy and you are capable of achieving multiple things but either there is lack of energy lack of motivation lack of something and this mentor is entering in your life to streamline everything to put you back on the track to put to bring discipline in your life to bring motivation in your life to bring uh, dedication and devotion in your life to bring that fiery passion yeah I, this is the word that i was looking out for the fiery passion the fiery passion is something that is missing right now okay you had that fire in the belly where is that fire pisces where is that fire that fire is missing since since long and probably also feel that this passion is is has sort of reduced or the fire has sort of reduced because you probably uh because you might have lost someone in the recent past i guess you probably you lost someone because there are a lot of signs uh, that are telling that there is stress in your life since long so either it's a loss of a relationship loss of a person maybe a loss of a job or financial difficulties that you are sailing through you know you probably are managing a uh, paycheck to paycheck it's a paycheck to paycheck situation that you are trying to manage in your life so don't feel i mean there is nothing to feel bad about it okay this person is not going to come and blame you because you are not motivated i mean he, this person knows that there are valid reasons because of which the fire is missing right now okay but universe has sent this person to do his or her job and they are going to do their job okay so this person is going to be a task master now this person will enter in your life either in form of a boss either in form of a new customer either a new neighbor with whom you're going to become friends with later on yeah it can be a new friend as well or it can also be a romantic partner for many of you this is going to be a romantic partner who will be your mentor as well sometimes you may not feel like uh, i don't think so i like uh, their way of doing things or the way they deal with me i uh, sometimes i don't appreciate that you might complain uh, about this person but they will do that for the love they have for you for the potential the hidden potential that they they are seeing in you you don't know but the world sees that they are trying to bring that potential out of you they'll push you into challenging situations like go manage the situation and you will be like i don't know how to do it but you this person will be like i don't know don't come back running to me i'm not going to help you this is something that you'll have to manage on your own go run around ask for help to the right kind of people don't come to me everything is something that you will have to manage on your own but you got to do that this person will keep on pushing you into challenging situations to pull that potential out of you
okay so you are meeting a mentor let's move on to the next one queen of cups Ooh, Pisces, you are finding someone special, very, very special. And I feel like this person is going to be your future spouse. This is the one with whom you will have kids, if at all you want to have kids. This is the person with whom you're going to grow old with. I mean, this person's love is going to be so addictive, like so crazily addictive. And they will have a very magnetic personality, like, you won't be able to stop yourself. You, This person is going to be irresistible. Okay, you will be like, that's it. My search is over. I'm going to be with this person. And they are going to be with me. We are going to get married. And we are we are going to be together lifelong. The, the moment you see this person, that moment itself, you're going to realize, Pisces, this, this is the person I'm going to be with. Then we have the star card, the third event. Okay. Star card is telling me, Pisces, that it's time for you to enjoy the fruits of your labor, fruits of your sacrifices that you have done. You no, know, not attending the parties and reducing your social life. And, uh, you know, you have done a lot of sacrifices. But it is time for you to enjoy the fruits of everything. The rewards. And the rewards in massive numbers are coming towards you. I feel like people who have presence on social media, especially if you're doing something online, okay? Whether it's an uh, influencer or anything, so online courses or uh, you have a channel on YouTube or you are, inf you are acting as an influencer on Instagram or you have a Twitter account, it's going to become famous. You will have a very strong social media presence. People will queue up to your channel and they will be desperately waiting. Like, when are you going to put that video? And when are you putting your next post? And when will write, I'm going to be the first one to comment and all that stuff. Okay. So you will see that your fan following is growing. Not only it's growing, like, you. I also feel that you're going to get good amount of revenue from that Pisces if you are a 9 to 5 person appreciation awards rewards are coming towards you promotion is happening maybe you are going to get selected for a uh, for a very unique project okay and that itself is going to be uh, it's going to be this like you know the the trust that the management is putting on you they believe you so much that this is a, the difficult project they have uh, not chosen anyone else, but they have chosen only you for this to lead this project. And it's going to be a feather in your cap. Like they have chosen you for this. Some once in a lifetime career related opportunities are coming towards you, uh, Pisces. So get ready for that. Okay. Um, for some of you, I am getting that it is likely you might meet someone special through your career in the month of May. Okay. Let's talk about your love life now. We have the tower, then we have seven of wands, and then we have the moon. Mm. Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Someone is stressed out that you're moving on. Someone is stressed out that you're not giving attention. Someone is stressed out that their life is becoming difficult without you. Unfortunately, they are having those realizations pretty late. Okay? Because with the tower moment, I do feel like even the cords that were attached to you and to this person, the last single cord that was attached for a very long period of time and you were waiting for like crazy when this cord will will end this connection between both of you even though there was a distance even after a breakup there was this still one single cord that was 
you know exchanging the energy between both of you and you wanted to stop it you wanted the cord you wanted to cut the cord and you probably did a lot of rituals and everything to cut the cord but somewhere the cord was kind of strong and it was deep rooted but in the month of may i think so you're going to cut the cord with the past you will succeed in cutting that one single final cord that was like notoriously exchanging the energies between you and your ex even after breakup and uh still like you know sometimes you found you found, you used to think about your ex and they used to think about you and then the energies used to get exchanged and then you used to feel irritated like why the hell i'm thinking about my ex and why i feel this person wants to talk to me and they want to come back and they want to text me and give me a call and all that stuff okay why why this this thing is still there between both of us i don't want anything to do with this person now i want to move on i want this one single cord uh, cord to go away okay so that's what exactly is happening even though they are realizing things even though they are missing you they want to fight for you they want to come towards you with certain confessions it's late it is late it is it is extremely extremely i mean i mean there is literally no point in this person trying to come back to you and rush towards you and you know pour their heart out the moment has passed and it has passed a long time back and this cord cutting by the universe is only confirming that the moment was passed a long time back <sighs> the moon is telling me someone is coming towards you conf- uh, with confessions okay now uh, yes apart from x i am also getting the energy of someone new okay this person is being sent towards you at the right time i do feel like there is lot of divine intervention in your life pisces lot of divine intervention like everything is happening at the perfect time everything is moving at the perfect time the cards are cut and now this new person is entering in your life and now they are opening up to you okay so till the time the cards were not cut the the right kind of person was not entering in your life and the cards are getting getting cut and you're starting a new cycle and then a lot of name fame and repetition is also coming towards you mentor is also entering in your life like everything it looks like everything is getting into sync and it's it's like everything is moving in sync and everything moves and is moving in sync because divine wants it to move in sync right now so things are happening at the perfect time in your life there is someone new that is coming towards you this person will from the very beginning itself i think so you will know and this person will know like both of you are meant for one another and confessions will happen real soon okay this person is going to be very 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 protective when it comes to you very protective whether it is male or female this person will stand up for you and you're going to love that so much you will really really love that Hmm. Why you're stressed out? Yeah. Uh stress related to some sort of losses, right? That's what I told you. By the way, you are also having a lot of options. You do have a lot of options, Pisces, when it comes to love and romance. Uh this is going to be a heart to heart connection. Your souls are going to recognize one another. but at the same time i mean even though there is going to be a pretty fast uh, realization about um and recognition about one another soul uh still for some of you this might be a slow moving connection the ultimate success is there for everyone but for some of you this is going to be fast moving connection for some of you this is going to be a slow moving connection 
depends upon the situations and circumstances and the distance between both of you and you know how busy one person is and uh, and how busy you are all right pisces i hope this resonates hit like share and subscribe and comment down below link for the extended is in description box and comment section in the extended we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you what action they will take towards you and likely conclusion between you and this person all right take care have a great time and bye bye pisces this is your spread